That pungent smell over the Yellowstone Valley, of course, means that the sugar beet harvest is well underway across Montana and northern Wyoming. The Montana Ag Network's Russell Nimitz reports tonight on the crop's importance to our region's economy. Economics of the sugar beet business have been very good for uh, all my life. Uh, sugar beets has been the mortgage lifter on a lot of farms. And uh, we've, had, we've had some tough times, but we've had some very good times. For Western Sugar Cooperative grower Irvin Schlemmer, this year marks his 46 sugar beet harvest. He says even with the ups and downs of the industry, beet harvest is still one of his favorite times of the year. I love digging sugar beets. I love the smell of sugar beets. It's one of them businesses that uh, we raise a lot of other crops too, but the sugar, sugar beet business is kind of in my blood. I've been involved in the, in the, uh, the politics of sugar and I know it from one end to the other. He says this year's crop will probably average in the low 30s as for tonnage per acre, a little bit less than what Western Sugar is projecting as a whole in Montana and Wyoming this year. He attributes severe weather as the culprit. It's a good average crop this year, at least in the Clarks Fork Valley. I think some, some areas that never received hail, I think they got a, they've got an excellent crop. Like I say, it's not going to be as good as the last year's crop or probably maybe even previous, but it looks like we're going to be happy with it. Dwayne Peters, egg manager for Sydney Sugars, says growers along the lower Yellowstone are also pleased with this year's beet crop. Right now the crop is looking good. We anticipate a ton at the end of the year of 32.5 tons per acre. Sugars, we just ran our first tear lab night and they came back 17.3, which is about 0.6 to 0.7 above the average. So we're very happy to see sugars this high for this time of year. Schlemmer says when sugar beet growers have a good year, so does Montana's overall economy. In Montana alone, it's $50 million business that puts in the economies for our, our, our local economies, our small towns, our downtown businesses. Doesn't matter if you're the co-op, if you're the grocery store, that's what, uh, that's what feeds this valley, helps feed it is the sugar beet business. And this year's full sugar beet harvest for both Western Sugar Cooperative and Sydney Sugars is set to begin the first week of October. Near Fromberg, Montana, Russell Nemitz, MTN News. Thanks, Russell. And Russell tells us, according to the latest statistics, the sugar beet crop in Montana involves as many as 42,700 acres, about the same as last year. Wyoming's acreage totals almost 40,000 acres. That's down about 700 acres from 2017. And the early sugar beet harvest actually got underway on the 4th of September. But as Russell told us, the regular harvest doesn't begin until about October 2nd.